Hey, what's up guys? And today I have a new beam with Matt. Now yes, I'm actually on my mattress now and I've not actually set my equipment up. I'm lazy, okay. Um it was set up earlier, however we had dog another dog over. So yeah. Now basically super dry top, bike shorts on, use it on my mat, so I'll set it out of last. Anyway, I've got my beam to set up, so I'm just setting it up over here and I'll show you a stead quick. Just give me a second. Now it is getting fairly dark. It's time to sit. By the end of this video it's gonna be pitch black. That's my guess. Anyway, beam is that. Pretty simple. Both of them are purple. I bought this the other day. Now Basically, what I'm going to be teaching you guys today is how to do your beat, your splits on beam. Yeah. Now, let me just set this map properly. Bought it the other day and it's already taken. Nice as that. Right, okay. This is my setup. That's because my foot, I would top it on that side. More right, right. right. I've got my hair up and it's in a bun because I actually quite like my hair like this now. Decided this is my new hairstyle. It's absolutely freezing out here so if I jet it in, that is why it is so cold. Um, anyway, beam, splits, boom. Right, okay, so first things first is finding a good camera angle. Uh, just that's not really good, right? Because all you're going to see there is my leg. Uh, so hot plate's not doing there. And... Uh, uh, there's not really going to be a good place. Okay, here we are. My mat. I didn't really hide where I've just had pizza and oh my god was it good. Anyway, if you're going to be doing your split sunbeams, you need to have a squared out hat. Get your good blade in front and just go and stretch. So, obviously, I'm just stretching that and going back. Just the same as usual. Now, I've basically done the stretch right there. So, I'm not really going to put it all again. And just square up your hips. This is going to be one of my short tutorials, as I don't really have much to say about it. And I just really wanted to get a video done before it's dark. <laughs> yeah. Right, okay, now, you got your spats and screwed out your hips that are fine and you've not got any problems. You can do, if you can do them over split, even better, you can use a beam for that. Uh, mine's just a floor beam, so it's a lot easier than having a high beam and putting your feet up there and trying to do the splits. Don't recommend. <laughs> uh, <laughs> right, okay. <laughs> I don't even know why I'm laughing. Right. Once you've done that, and you're ready to go and beam. So, I'm going to hope this is a good enough angle. If it's not, then I'm very sorry. My front foot's going to be here, back foot's going to be all the way at the other side. Wonder what this is? It's a wristband from my art tent that we got it last week. Now, anyway, back on beam. So, just that you're going to do your splat stretch, however you want to do it on the beam, making sure your hips are definitely squared out and not just what you think is Oh god, I can't balance on this. That's one thing that I really can't do on beam, is balance. And that's what it's for, God's sake. <laughs> and that's what it's for. <laughs> beam is probably my worst apparatus. Actually, I take that back. Bars is my worst apparatus. Beam is definitely next. Uh, table vault, probably. Uh, oh god. Uh, uh, air track, trampoline, so trumpet, and then mm, floor, then normal vault. Now by trumpet, I don't mean like my trampoline because it as, as you could possibly tell, <laughs> as you could possibly tell, I'm fairly skilled on that. Um, and also, I just got my... I don't know what it's called. 
um, like, oh, this is why I'm bad with names, guys, right? So you, it, it's like you're doing a handspring, right? And <laughs> instead of putting your hands on the floor when you go to do it, you, like, jump a few times, and instead of getting your hands to touch the floor, they kind of, like, float over the ground, and your body follows. And I think it's called Brani, so don't take my word. Um, so, oh god, um, okay. <laughs> After you stuck your stretch on the beam and your hips are definitely squared, and you're better bound to it than this and me, you want to just go straight into your splits. And you should just be able to sit and be free. I need to take a chill pill. Um, anyway, if you want to see something cool, like really cool, go to my Life You Wonderful channel because guess what, guys? I never went to Spain. Wow. <laughs> no, I never went to Spain because my cousin did, and they brought me the biggest thing of full of sweets, and I'm ready to try like a load of them. This me <laughs> buy a load of sweets. I mean this might take up like three parts like of it like a series thing right <laughs> i can't read spanish so what if got spanish sweets who doesn't want them and uh, two it's in spanish so i don't know what the hell they are so guessing game here i come and three i'm going to be on a super rush <laughs> even better guys if you want to see me more hyper than this check out like team one two three i will leave <laughs> Oh, I will leave a like in the description below. I hope you guys enjoyed this beam tutorial. Um, I get I'm not getting this, but like, we get cheap. And, <laughs> bye guys.